On this channel, we had taken a look at Hyperite a few weeks back, but today I want to take a look at another cool feature that they just recently released, and that's the Hyperite Assistant. Now, they are rolling out with an agent studio, which is probably one of the best or one of the first, I would say, AI agent systems with real world use cases. For the people who do not know, Hyperite is a personal AI system that lets you deploy AI agents on your operating system so that it can carry out different sorts of tasks, whether that's booking a reservation, sending out emails and such forth. Previously, we had taken a look at the all-in-web extension, and this is basically where the AI-powered assistants are deployed and they're focused on web browsing, content creation, online research, as well as task automation. Now, we have a chance to create our own AI assistants with this new upgrade that they're releasing fairly soon. And this basically means that you will be able to use their agent studio, which gives you more flexibility to create various sorts of AI agents. Just take a look at this demo video. Sorry for being repetitive, but this month we had insane partnerships with big companies giving out subscriptions to AI tools completely for free. These are tools that will streamline your business's growth and improve your efficiency. Just being a patron this past month, you were given access to six paid subscriptions completely for free. Not only do you access these subscriptions, but you gain the ability for consulting, networking, collaborating with the community, as well as with myself. You get access access to daily AI news, resources, giveaways, and so much more. If you're interested, check out the Patreon link in the description below to gain access to these benefits. Now, in this demo video, we are deploying our own AI agent workflow through the new Hyperite Agent Studio. And in this particular example, they're basically deploying an AI agent that is being created from Agent Studio to RunPod. Now, for the people who do not know, RunPod is a cloud GPU service. And in this case, they're deploying the AI agent from Hyperite on this site to execute the task of deploying a cloud GPU from it, as well as gathering different sorts of GPUs. And we can see from this example that you can grab that workflow, you can open it up and you can have it so that once it has finished executing that task, you can then retrieve the information that it had gathered. So in this case, you can see in this example where it has specified what requirements are needed to run that certain GPU that high, or that run pod actually provides. And you can specify and tweak it to your use case. And this is one of the great flexibilities of this new agent framework or the studio, sorry, because it basically allows you to work alongside with it to deploy different sorts of AI agents to execute different sorts of tasks. Now, throughout today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at this agent studio further in detail, as this is one of the first AI agent systems with practical use cases. So with that thought guys, stay tuned and let's get straight into the video. If you would like to book a one-on-one -on -one with me where you can access my consulting services, where I can help you grow your business or basically give you a lot of different types of solutions with AI. Definitely take a look at the calendar link in the description below. Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video at the world of AI. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the agent studio from Hyperite. Now, this is a new upgrade that will simplify the process of creating AI agents significantly. You can basically start by clicking record on their dashboard. And from there, you can have it so that the AI agents that are being deployed can perform the tasks that you want. And the AI will basically learn and then save it into its database. It can then further customize the workflow by making edits. It can also specify decision making criteria and such forth. Now, once you have saved after you have recorded your prompt, you can basically edit the workflow so that it can be executed whenever you want. And it's quite powerful because it has the ability to be incorporated with different variables. So it will allow for flexibility when you're handling different tasks and it will basically have it so that it can be flexible as to where you want it to be deployed. Now, whenever I tend to cover any sort of project, I tend to gas it up a lot. And in no way, this is a sponsored video. This is just a random product that I thought would be useful for you guys. So I'm sorry if I do sound like some marketing cook who's just trying to push some random product onto you. It's no sponsored video. This is just something that I thought would be beneficial for you. But the main reason why I really wanted to take a look at this again is because it's 
significantly improving the process of creating AI agents. And not just basic AI agents. These are quite intricate and they can do various sorts of tasks. And the great functionality of this new platform is that it has the ability to autonomously accomplish your task, meaning that you can have it so that it will do it without any sort of intervention. You can have it work on its own. And whenever you want to input your own feedback, you can stop it, tweak and edit the prompt, and then you can have it generated based off the context that you gave it further. So how can you get started? Well, this is an extension that you can download with Google Chrome, and this is where you can have it running on your web browser. So what you can do is add it just to your Chrome. And once you have done that, we can then further move on to this video. Well, now, once it has done that, I'll be right back. So once it has finished installing, you'll be then sent over to this dashboard where it will then welcome you to Hyperite. It will then focus on some of the capabilities of it, but then you can simply just click continue. And once that is done, it's going to go over some useful tips. You can skip through all this by just clicking on skip. And once that is done, you'll be then sent over to the personal assistant tab. This is where you can create new chats. And then this is where you can have it so that there is a prompt system that you can create for your AI agents so that they can execute various tasks. So in this case, there's different categories as to what they've developed for different prompts. For writing, you can have it so that an AI agent can rewrite your content, flexible auto write, which will use AI to help you write anything or accomplish nearly any task. You have education where you're explaining things like you're five years old. You have business prompts or agents, which can be an email responder, cover letter uh, generator, sorry. Uh, you have marketing where you have expert marketing assistants, Facebook post generator, as well as many others. And you can view more and look through a whole huge catalog of different prompts and different AI agents that you can use. Now, say if you want to create a tool that would help you for web development. So what you can do in this case is that you can simply just click on others. You can scroll up and just click on create tool. Now, this is a new feature, which is in beta. You can just simply describe it. So in this case, I'm gonna give it a description and I'll be right back. So there we go. I gave it this description where you are a personal web development assistant. You will provide me with the code that is needed to create and build web projects. So now I'm gonna click create tool. It's gonna to start creating this tool and this might take a couple of seconds. So once this is done, I'll be right back. And there we go. Now it will then generate the description, the name of it, as well as provide you a better instruction. And this will then put it into the education category. And what you can do is you can then see that you're able to provide it a project description where now this tool is gonna help you execute different sorts of projects or developments for projects. So in this case, in th there's an example already stated that I'm building a personal blog with React and Node.js. You can use certain programming languages as well as specific tasks and problem. And you can see that this was fully created from that simple instruction that I gave it. Now, if you wanna test it, you can simply just go and submit this. And we can see that this agent will then work on figuring out the things that are needed. So I actually should have inputted something into this. So let me go back and let me input a description, a programming language, as well as a specific task. And there we go. So I basically have it so that I gave it a project description where I'm building a consulting page for my AI business. Please help me create it. I'm gonna be focusing on using HTML, React, and I also stated that you can use any sort of language that you want. And I also gave it a specific task or problem where I wanted to create me a nice web page so that my clients can book meetings off that consulting page. And we can see that it's working on creating the basic code with HTML. It's focusing on creating the React components. And if we go down, it also explains what you can do over here to have it functional. And you can even publish this bot so that you can use it later for any sort of task. And the great part is, is that this extension can be like usable anywhere. So if you can click on extensions, I'm going to quickly find it right over here. You can log in once you have logged in to your Hyperite uh, email. You can then have it executable on different web pages. Now, the cool thing with this company is that they have a lot of cool tools 
relating to AI and they have an AI tools set where you can use different sorts of tools to have it executable on your web browser where you can have it send out content generation emails you can have it send out twitter posts as well as execute various sorts of tasks that you want so definitely take a look at this because they have a lot of different things that you can do with it and that's about it for today's video on Hyperite. This is definitely something that you should take a look at because they have made it super easy for you to create any sort of AI agent that you want. And this is something that you can do completely for free. So I will leave all these links in the description below so that you can check it out. Make sure you check out the Patreon page if you guys haven't already. This is a great way for you to access our private Discord as well as amazing subscriptions completely for free. Make sure you follow us on Twitter if you guys haven't already. This is a great way for you to stay up to date with the latest AI news. And lastly, make sure you guys subscribe, turn on notification bell, like this video, and check out our previous videos so you can stay up to date with the latest AI news. But with that thought, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Have an amazing day. Spread positivity, and I'll see you guys fairly shortly. Peace out, fellas.